Well, good morning and welcome back to Dealer Simulator. Let's see what we got. Oh, cool. We got a couple of those new uh, cars from the update. Oh, jeez. Um, <laughs> how do we put it back in? This one's broken. Um, shoot. Oh, nuts. Put it away. Okay. Yeah, I want to put it... Oh, shoot. <laughs> oh, good. I put it back into the the box. Well, it's working. Something was broken, though. Should we try it? Let's put it down on the ground here. Where'd it go? Okay. <laughs> Where'd it go? Okay. <laughs> oh, that's cool. See when the car's not in there, the box shows broken. Oh, jeez. Okay, if you get back in your car, wait a minute. Uh. If you get back in the car, then it puts it back in its box. That's good. So that's part of the new update. That's cool. We got one, and it looks like we got two of them. Sweet. Okay, what do we got here? Oh, let's just open it. Mouse, a three dollar mouse. Yeah, that won't be going with us. <laughs> picture. Hoping for a computer would be nice. Uh, let's get a little subwoofer. Put that in the van and hook it up. <laughs> and a $420 ring. That's not bad. We definitely need to get some stuff here. Oh, we got some scrap. We can use that for fixing stuff. Water glasses. Yeah, let's search that. Oh yeah, we can do this. One, we can do one, two, and Q. Oh, one, two, and three. And then grab. Okay. So we can hold one and two and grab an item. Yeah, these are both going in the recycle. Let's uh, grab and put them in here. Nice. Okay, now let's move to the next locker. Got everything out of there. No, oh, come on. Oh, I hope there's
there's a computer in here. Okay. Oh, an RC truck. Sweet. Let's take a look at it. These days I'll get stopped doing that. Those boxes always go flying, don't they? Come on. Okay, we got some, what's that? Oh, it's just a magazine, it kind of blends in with the ground, doesn't it? It is, it looks invisible. Okay. Oh, nice, the computer. Okay. A hundred dollar computer. Yeah, it looks kind of looks like my last computer that I had somebody build for me. Kind of ugly. <laughs> I'm glad I did my own computer this time. I was able to get a case that's not ugly and the computer is a lot better than it was. Okay, what do we got? A lot of shoes. Shoot, I was hoping for the $7,000 uh, rifle. <laughs> but I didn't look out this time. <laughs> Okay, let's see, let's grab. And that looks like all the garbage, so we'll go throw that out. lockers this time around. You know, those RC cars are cool, but they're not really that high a price. Not for the amount of money I spent. like that box fan I saw in that vi in your video they still haven't fixed this where they get something on the ground and you can't pick it up but yeah I like the box fan but I don't know well that's just trash isn't it yeah it is not worth nothing whoops See, missing it's only fifteen dollars and it's gonna be three bucks to fix it. That one might be worth it. That 
chair is gonna get I'm just gonna pitch these don't really need that dollar or whatever it's gonna caught be I guess you have to be above the rim of the box okay we got a chair still and that I don't think I'm gonna fit the chair not from this angle at least Okay, let's grab the shoes. Oh, she's, it's like it's warping through. I thought part of the patch notes said that they fixed the stuff falling through the floor. It's one of the uglier chairs. <laughs> we just got to get it in there just enough to where I can come on, so I can close the door and try to lock it in there. Okay, well I'll meet you over at the store. I'm not gonna put you through <laughs> this whole trying to get this thing to fit in here. Okay, we are back to the store. Got a few items here we could start putting out. Uh, let's see, one and two. We got some of the stuff that we need to have fixed. Okay, I'm gonna try this where we don't have to price things. I don't know if I grabbed a third item. I can't see good enough to, <laughs> to see if I picked it up or not. Okay, let's, uh, I've got another big spot here on the floor there. Did that price? Yep, that did it. Okay, and now um, let's see, where should we put this one? I don't know if I should put it on the table or if I should just wait and put it on the floor once I get... Yeah, we'll put it on the table because that way it's... I don't know, it, it doesn't really fit, does it? No, not what I wanted to do. I want to put it away. I don't know how to do it other than going getting in the in the truck to get it to go back in the box when you accidentally open it. Now it's trying to list it. Did it post just the one? Nice. Okay. Let's get everything on the shelf and I want to try this and see if it works using the the guy to price everything on the table. Okay, that one's broke. I think broke. Broken, broken, and broke. Oh, great, they're all broken. Okay, we're gonna go put these. The repair bench. We gotta hire our guy that, to fix stuff. Repair, and our search. Okay. Oh, they're not here during the oh, closed hours. I guess I shouldn't have hired them quite yet then. Yep, we got two things on there. Well, that worked. <laughs> dropped it right on. Oh shoot. Okay, let's uh, still trying to get used to the whole using the hands thing. Get all the broken stuff back there. Ah, uh, dang it, I should not have hired those guys quite yet. Unless, hopefully they're not getting paid until I, until open. Yeah, that locker, those two lockers kind of sucked. <laughs> I get a lot of broken stuff in it. I guess if we could do the, the search guy, we can tell him to price everything and he'll, he'll, he'll price everything on the tables which I am looking forward to that not have to go from shelf to shelf pricing everything okay we got oh the cameras even broken <laughs> you know, more broken stuff than I got good stuff this time around I'm loving the three hand carrying stuff though Boy, that's saving some time uh, the chair, I don't know where we can fit it. Uh, I put it on two shelves, but I guess that's okay. Is that a second camera, or did I... Huh. I thought I had another camera, but I guess that is the same one, huh? Oh, I think I've got one broken camera, too. Yeah, see, I can't reach these. It's frustrating not being able to reach them that close. That's weird. Okay, I'm not, okay, I'm pushing forward. And now I, I'm not gonna touch you, I'm just gonna let go of the, um, I let go of the W. And it's just automatically driving backwards. I'm like fighting, trying to go forward. 
because I let off the W and it tries to drive backward on its own, not touching any other buttons. It turned it off to not move. That's a bug. To let him know that the that it tries to drive itself backwards. The van. I don't know if anybody else is having that problem with it. That put him. Huh? It worked. Put them on the shelves. Okay, let's, uh, now we got everything out. We're gonna jump to our truck. It, the truck's doing it too. It won't even let me drive forward. It won't let me shut it off either. Yeah, I'm hitting the E and it won't shut off. Just gotta get out. For some reason it won't it's automatically trying to drive backwards. Wouldn't even let me drive forward with that one. That's not good. Yeah, see it automatically started trying to drive backwards. Just getting in it. Well, that's a new bug. Okay, now we're open. Let's go have this guy price everything. Let's see. Research and price shop products. Okay, let's go see if is everything priced. No. Um hey. Research and price the products on the shelves. What is it? How long does it take him to do it? Hopefully he just keeps repairing stuff or are they all fixed? No, I don't see any of them fixed. Why does it say that they've already been fixed? I don't see any fixed items on the table. Are you serious? I have to take them all off just to get... Oh, that sucks. So I gotta put one item at a time. Item already been repaired. Okay, well that... Well, that one's working now. Oh, seriously? I'm gonna have to go and put all of them on his table. And I didn't even price it. Okay, what's the point of that guy if he's not going to go around and price everything on the tables? Research and price products on shelves. Do it. Yeah, and then you're going to try to rip me off for the one product I've actually got priced? <laughs> 85. Okay. Shoot. I was hoping it was working. Maybe, maybe it does, and I'm... Because I know you said that we could do that, put it, and it would tell them to price it, and they would price the stuff on the shelves, but I'm not... It didn't work. I don't know if maybe my gum is, my game has just gotten bugged with the whole truck screwing up thing. Because even when I had him price it on the table, he still didn't work. Thirty-five. Oh, ten dollars. Oh, I should not even have bothered with that one. Thirty-five. Shoot, I was hoping that was gonna work. Nice. That's what I like to see. 350. See, I don't understand if he's not gonna actually price the stuff. Yeah, the last girl tried to do that to me too with the with that last one. Oh, it's another ten dollar pair of shoes. Five hundred dollar ring, not bad. Is that what we're supposed to do? Just go up to him. Let me know in the comments if that's what you meant. By just going to tell it even when I put the thing on his workbench it still didn't price it when I put it on the shelf. Is my game just bugged? Did that work for you? Because it's not working for me for some reason. Those are big RC cars for that low of a price. I like having the repair guy list close. Okay, let's see, what are you trying to get? Yeah, take it. Uh, let's see, 50 bucks. Oh, I was all excited about being able to just tell that guy to price the stuff and having it priced. It's like, what's the point of having him here if he's not going to do that, you know? Maybe they will. It's just my, for some reason, mine's bugged right now or something. Yeah, okay. 
could be tied to the the whole um, car bug or something that's going on. Nice. I do love it when they give me what I'm asking. <laughs> it says 35. Let's get him to price. Worker researched price. 35 bucks. Now let's go put it on a shelf and see if that if it prices it when I put it on the shelf. Still didn't. Because I can already see the price. Because I've got that upgrade. I wonder if that's mostly for people that don't have that that upgrade yet. So they don't have to go to the computer to, f to get the stuff fixed. Or to get the stuff researched. Which that, that's cool, but having the 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 upgrade I've got it's kind of pointless for me you know what I'm saying the repair guy's handy it's just this guy let's uh now let's try the other Okay, so it says a hundred dollars. Let's pick it up by doing the other um, kind of research. Let's see if that works to get it to price it on the table. Okay, now let's go have him price table stuff on the shelves and see if it worked. Nope. So we gotta still have to manually price everything. That that kind of stinks a little bit. <laughs> I was kind of really looking forward to that. That computer, I don't think, and now I think about it, I probably shouldn't have fixed it because it was, uh, what, $71 to fix it and it caught and it sells for 100 bucks. Not much in the way of profit. I think I'm going to fire the research guy for right now because he's really doing me no, no good. Pair guy I'll keep, but the he that guy is real pointless once you have that um that upgrade. Oh, let's uh speaking of upgrades. There we go. Lord of the shelves. Okay. Worker researches items and enters the on the okay. Now he's actually gonna be that's what the whole thing was. Okay, well, I'll rehire him. And now let's try it. Where he'll price the stuff on the shelves. Which, it figures, now I, um, really don't have anything left to price. But that, that could be why it wasn't working for me. Okay, we'll go s see if he can research on table. Holy cow, he's slow. The last guy was quick. Okay. Now, let's go set it on the table. Please let it work. Now we put it on. Is it going to price it? Well, let's go have price on shelves. Still did not work. Shoot, I was hoping that, that upgrade would have fixed that, but it didn't. Holy cow, that's a big difference, lady. <laughs> Whoa, not that. That would have been not much better. Yeah, go away. Where's my baseball bat? <laughs> like you said, I should set it on the table here and let it be an incentive to not insult me by offering hardly any money. Yeah, go ahead, take it not quite as insulting as the last one okay we're gonna instead of having him price I'm gonna go put it on the cha on the bench table and then uh cannot be soul damaged what um 900 as low as I'm gonna go for this thing there we go okay now why is it saying something about you cannot sell damaged items 
I'm not trying to sell damaged items. Okay, let's go have him research on the shelves. Okay, now let's go see if it did a price. It did, okay. Now it worked. Figures, it worked in the last item. <laughs> the very last item that I have left. And it worked. Okay, well let's, we don't need the repair guy or the researcher anymore. So we're gonna lay them both off. No sense of having them on payroll when I have nothing for them to do. Uh, 475. 470. She's gonna be cheap. Yeah, go away. <laughs> you know when they come in asking for that low, and you try to give them a reasonable amount off, and they turn it down, there's no sense of even playing around with it because they're not going to give you a new decent price. See, again, 115. And my dyslexia shows its head. No more. It's like I was typing 115 and it typed out 151. Yes. Um, 100, as low as I will go. Yep, go away. Shock, shock, nobody wants the crappy computer. <laughs> Does it even have an HDMI on it? On the graphics card? Doesn't look like it. Yeah, take it. You cannot sell damage. I know this. Why are they saying that? Let's go look around, see if we have any damaged product on the shelves. I don't think I do. No? Try to give me half. Not gonna happen, lady. <laughs> Wait a minute, I didn't check this one. Oh! And I've already fired my repair guy. Yeah, we'll leave it for tomorrow. Uh, 425. Jeez, no. Yeah, some, I just don't even feel like haggling some of them. Now we have that steady stream. Yep. Steady stream of people walking till they come in. Which that was good. He came in pretty quick. Oh, 475. Take it. Yes. Okay. What sold for 475? Oh, that was that bracelet or necklace, whichever it was. At least the people are coming in pretty quick this time. Yeah, it's close enough. <laughs> Computer shock, shock, it's still there. Back up to 4,000. Be able to get a couple more lockers, and now that I know that that's going to work, let's put it on the... Oh, somebody's coming for that computer. I'm just going to take whatever he offers now, because I, already, I spent 71 bucks to fix a $100 computer. Oh, good. I'm glad he took it for what it was worth. Oh, cool. Somebody's come for the RC truck. Or is that the car? Oh, yeah, the truck sold already. Nice. I have three. I think I got three items left. Yep. Somebody's come for the new shoes. Yeah, take them. Last couple things. Come for the sub. Nice. People are actually giving me what I'm asking. It's kind of weird. The wind's coming out of the s northeast today. Usually it does not come out of the northeast. It's either the north or the south or s northwest. East winds here are unusual. But we've got one today. Shifting a little more from the north, but... Uh, no.
nobody wants the movie. Go out there and see the people. Steady stream. Yep. Popping up out of the ground. <laughs> Let's see my truck. See if it fixed itself or if it still broke. Okay, it fixed. Yeah, that, that was just really weird. It trying to drive on its own. Oh, it automatically closed. We can't reopen. Oh, well, we can. For some reason, it closed automatically. But it, it might just not, people might not come in anymore with it open, even open. Okay, well, the next episode, we will be heading back over to the lockers and probably spending all that money on getting some more lockers. Hopefully we can get a hold of one of those rifles that's like a $7,000 rifle. <laughs> would really be cool. And see some of the other cool stuff that they have. Oh, cool. I didn't even realize that. A mark of quality. I didn't realize it was up on the actual sign. Well, that's awesome. Okay, well, thank you so much for watching, everybody. I really appreciate it. Thank you for all the support. Um, Heather, thank you so much uh, for being a channel member. If you are interested in becoming a channel member, please hit that join button. Uh, it's very little a month, uh, and it helps me out greatly. Uh, every penny to help keep this channel going is very appreciated. Uh, thank you so much for all the comments and the likes and, and views on the videos. Have a great rest of your day, and I will talk to you in the comments.